There's lots of talk about autonomous emergency braking or AEB in new cars, but how does this important safety feature really work? Let's find out. You'll find AEB a standard feature in most new cars today, but you might hear it called something else because many car manufacturers have their own name for it. Some of those include forward collision mitigation, smart city brake support, multi-collision braking, city collision braking, and more. There are three different types, low speed, high speed, and pedestrian systems, all using cameras, lasers, or sensors on the front of the car to detect a possible collision. To test in real world conditions, we're using a 2019 Forester fitted with Subaru's comprehensive safety suite called EyeSight Driver Assist Technology. Subaru uses the term pre-collision braking, but it's the same as AEB. In most cases, AEB uses a combination of cameras, sensors or lasers to detect the speed and distance of vehicles in front of you. It'll automatically apply the brakes in an emergency situation if you don't react. To reduce the severity of an accident or avoid it altogether. There's a difference between autonomous emergency braking and forward collision warning or brake assist. AEB will react by autonomously braking even without any driver input, while forward collision warning uses audible and visual warnings to tell the driver that it's time to brake if it sees something in front of the vehicle. And lastly, brake assist increases braking pressure if it thinks the driver isn't coming to a stop quick enough, but only once you've already started braking. There are three types of AEB systems low speed, high speed, and pedestrian or cyclist systems. Low speed or city AEB works up to speeds of around 25 to 30 kilometers an hour, depending on the vehicle, and it usually only uses one camera. High speed works up to Aussie highway speeds and beyond, using radars and cameras to detect any obstacles in front of the car. It also controls things like adaptive cruise control. Pedestrian and cyclist systems are able to detect more distinct shapes like those of a human. The Forester we're testing here has Subaru's EyeSight driver assist technology, which uses all three systems, but not every vehicle gets a combination of all three. So be sure you know what you're getting when purchasing your next car. Something very important to remember is that safety systems like AEB are not designed to replace the driver. So it's very important you give your full attention and concentration to the task at hand. So there you have it. AEB can save you from having a minor prank or potentially something worse. But remember, there's no substitute for keeping your eyes on the road. And we'd like to thank ANCAP for helping us with this demonstration.